Raya ya Singapura sama sama menuju bahagia cita-cita kita yang mulia berjaya Singapura mari kita bersatu dengan semangat yang baru semua kita berseru majulah Singapura majulah Singapura Zubir Said, I think that was it. I don't even know. Zubir Said, he's the uh, one of the people in the first BAP part. I don't know his name. Started with R. Ah. Alright. I don't know in English is onward Singapore. I don't know that. I didn't really go on my check up the meaning. So, yeah. And I don't really understand Malay. On Singapore? Is it? Independence Day To be united yeah. As a country I only understand Singapore Like How do you say it? Like we as one as a country United as one? Uh, Something about all words Singapore Yes Yeah <laughs> okay. Yeah, because in the kindergarten, I just sang the first half. Uh, for me, I never sang the national anthem in kindergarten until I went to primary school. Uh, I did not really look into what the lyrics meant. Nah. Same. Yeah. Thank you. I think it is important for Singaporeans to like, sing, memorize and sing the national anthem because it is one of our identity. I also do agree that uh, singing the national anthem, and I feel like it can unite the Singaporeans, and then all the race will be able to work together as one. I think it's best to know. Uh, it's good to also know, uh, so that they can they they can know the purpose of why the national anthem was written. Why was it written this way, and like why were the lyrics put there instead of other. Other lyrics, yeah. Yes, because uh, you are Singaporean, uh, you have the pride, and think you should know. Yeah. I think you should know the lyrics and to sing it, because you're Singaporean, you should be proud of it. This, this, the anthem was created when we gained our independence, so it is really significant to us. You must first understand the lyrics, then you can understand the lyrics. Mari kita raya Singapura sama-sama menuju bahagia. Come fellow Singaporeans, let us progress towards happiness together. Cita-cita kita yang mulia berjaya Singapura. May our noble aspiration bring Singapore success. Mari dia. Kita bersatu dengan semangat yang baru. Come, let us unite in a new spirit. Semua kita bersatu majulah Singapura. Let our voices soar as one onward Singapore. After Singapore became a self-governing state in 1959, the song was adopted as the state national anthem. When Singapore gained independence on 9 August 1965, Majula Singapura then became the national anthem of the Republic of Singapore. So beer was moved by the social and political awakening of the people at that time. Many before did not feel a strong sense of belonging to Singapore. But in the 1950s and 1960s, the locals in Singapore felt that they wanted to decide Singapore's fate as a country. So we have felt that the song would have to capture that mood, embody the spirit of challenge and heighten the feelings of the people towards Singapore. At that time, there were many riots and strikes in Singapore. Zubir wanted to unite Singaporeans through this anthem. He chose simple and meaningful words for the lyrics so that the song could be easily understood and sung by all races in Singapore. He also felt that since not many people spoke English in Singapore at that time, a song with Malay lyrics could be easily understood and remembered and would appeal to all races in the multi-racial society. Today, the song is meant to continue to inspire all of us Singaporeans to unite as one people and rally as one and work towards success for Singapore. Singapore is still a multi-racial country 
the words which ran through them still hold meaning for all of us today. The national anthem is actually very meaningful when you know its backstory. I think if you know the backstory, you feel very inspired. We must be respectful when we are singing the national anthem. We must sing it loud and clear so that we can be united <laughs> as one. You know? Yes. Please sing it loud. Um, do it with pride. Yeah. Stop keeping quiet. Um, I definitely understand more um, about the about the national anthem and since now I know um, the meaning behind it like, it's actually quite uh, thoughtful of Zubay Sayed to make it make the lyrics simple and easy to easy to memorize because it, it's very catchy also.